Welcome to Send of Frankie's Mountain Bike Adventures. Our adventure this week will be a three-part series of how we ended up in Sedona to tackle one of the most famous trail systems named Hogs. Our journey began roughly two months ago, specifically after watching Colorado Kids' video on Downeyville. A good friend of the channel, Nico and I, both wanted to ride Downeyville for quite a while now. Downeyville offers some of the most epic trails in all of California. And only being eight hours away, we just couldn't let another season pass without riding the epic spot. But as California entered its fire season, our forest was devastated by wildfires and we were hit with forest closures throughout the state of California. We had high hopes for the fire to be clear by the time we reach our travel date, but as we moved closer and closer, we just couldn't make sure if the shuttle services or the air quality be worth the trip up north. Ellen and I were both pretty bummed out. We were pretty hyped for this trip as it would have been her first trip to Northern California. So we quickly planned for a sure win trip to Sedona, Arizona since our last trip there was beyond amazing. My mom decided she also wanted to join in on the adventure. She hasn't gotten out since the pandemic and since this was just three of us, adding my mom into the mix was gonna be something special. We started planning and looking around for possible places to stay. And with travel dates being so close, the prices were pretty expensive. We got pretty excited when we found a trailer RV on Airbnb. It was located in Cottonwood, a small town just outside of Sedona, and the prices was just right for our last minute effort. We didn't know what to expect from the trailer, but it was worth the shot. We love adventuring and exploring, and would love to share the experience with my mom. So I got to work on all three bikes prior to our road trip, and let me tell you, it's not an easy task to work on three bikes, especially with my amateurish mechanical skills. I pretty much packed my entire bike garage, Tires, chains, cables, brake pads, tools, sealant, you name it. We even washed the car, cleaned all the windows for the road trip, and bought some new windshield wipers from Costco. With everything packed into my tiny truck, our goal was in sight. Both Ellen and I were super excited at the same time, fearing the unknown. We had so many questions regarding the RV that we rented on Airbnb. We weren't sure if it would fit all of us. And based off of the pictures on the host's page, we weren't sure if the utilities worked correctly or if the living spaces were clean and comfortable. On top of that, I wasn't even sure if my mom would find this trip enjoyable. She's not an outdoor person at all, and Sedona is famous for its trails and spectacular views. And speaking of trails, my number one concern for the trip is, will we be able to complete hogs even if we walked it? With so many unknowns, it is only fitting to go head on Cinder Frankie style which really means just wing it. I hope you guys enjoyed this week's quick prelude to our Sedona trip. Tune in next episode to see how everything turned out. So please hit that like button and subscribe so you won't miss our next upload. Peace.